This was such a brilliant argument from John Lennox. Check it out. God is not a God of the gaps. He is the most powerful explanatory power to make sense of the whole thing. I'm a mathematician. The very fact that we can do mathematics to me is an indicator that this is a word-based universe. The very fact that in biology we've discovered the longest word, the human genome, 3.4 billion word, uh, letters in the chemical alphabet, is evidence of an intelligent mind. That's not a mind of the gaps. It's the only thing that makes sense. Now I'm looking around the room, but the lights are blind to me. Oh yes, I see a word up there, prayer. How very suitable. There are two, four, six letters. The moment you see that, what do you deduce? You can see letters. They have meaning to you. You cannot explain that meaning in terms of the physics and chemistry of the paper and paint there. But the moment you see that, there are many mechanical processes that went in producing that sign. But you know, because that carries meaning, it's a word that behind it there was a mind. Not a mind of the gaps, but a mind that's the only sensible explanation of what you're reading up there.